Hello there everyone! The Ice Cream Dragon is the new Dragon of the Month in Dragon Mania Legends and is available to breed for the whole of July. So let's look at the best combinations you can use to breed this delicious looking dragon this month. The Ice Cream Dragon is a legendary with the water, plant and legendary elements and he has a regular breeding time of 2 days or 1 day and 14 hours if you have VIP active. And to breed the ice cream, you need to breed together two dragons that have the plant, wind, water, and fire elements. Now, there are a lot of different combinations you can use. However, the best combination you can use overall is the nurture plus fire dragons. This combo is going to give just over a 4% chance to breed the legendary ice cream dragon with up to just 5 other possible outcomes if you have VIP level 4 or above. Apart from the elixir and a gave dragons, the other 3 possible outcomes have extremely low breeding times, so this combination is honestly really good and I would recommend using it for anybody that has a nurture dragon. However, the nurture dragon is a hard dragon to get a hold of since it isn't available to breed currently. So the second best breeding combination I would suggest for you to use would be the Agave plus Wind Dragons. This combo gives about a 2.8% chance to breed the ice cream with up to 7 other possible outcomes. Excluding the Elixir Dragon, the other possible outcomes again have pretty low breeding times of 8 hours or below, but this combination has dragons that are really easy to breed. If you do need help with how to breed an Agave Dragon, then fear not! I will explain how to breed him a little later on in the video. But if you don't have any Epic Dragons to use initially to breed the Ice Cream, then fear not! Because I do have two more breeding combinations that you can use that only use common dragons. These are the Smoke Plus Melon Dragons, or the Seed Plus Boiling Dragons. And both of these combinations give about a 2% chance to breed the ice cream and have up to 9 other possible outcomes. They are worse than the combinations that use epic dragons, however the plus side to these combos is that they give you the chance to breed the agave dragon. This means that you can start off by using these basic combinations if you don't have the agave dragon to use, and then you might actually end up breeding him by accident while going for the ice cream and then you can swap to the better combination later on, so it's basically a win-win situation. And now for the big question, what levels would I recommend for you to use? Well, I would suggest using level 15 to 20 dragons to try and breed him, if you can afford the food to do so. Obviously, the higher the level of your breeding dragons, the higher your odds are of breeding the legendary ice cream dragon, but there's no need to go crazy with the levels, so 15 to 20 should work just fine. Please do remember though, this is a legendary dragon we're trying to breed here, and his chances to be bred are very low, only going up to 5% with certain combos, so chances are it will take you a lot of breeding attempts before you get him. You just need to be patient and trust that the combos do work. The order of your dragons doesn't matter either, so you don't even need to worry about that. You just gotta keep trying and hope that luck is on your side this month. Like I said before though, these aren't the only combos you can use and there are still some good combos out there, so let me know which combinations you're using or how you managed to breed the ice cream yourself. Apart from that, all I can do is wish you the very best of luck. Thank you very much for watching and if you need any other help then please do feel free to leave a comment below or join our DML Discord server where you can get real-time help from either myself and many other DML players as well. But for now, thank you very much for watching, and until next time, I will see you then.